No. Miguel, no. Charity, what? We can't do this. We can't. We can't be together. Not now, not ever. How can you say that, Charity? How can you say that we can't ever be together? It just has to be this way. But why? I love you with all of my heart, okay? And I know that you love me. You can't just push me away. We're meant to be together. We have to be. We can't be. Why? <sighs> Charity, answer me. Why can't we be together? You have responsibilities, Miguel. You have to take care of the baby. You have to take care of Kay. I, I just get in the way. How can you even think that? Okay, I've told you over and over again that I can be responsible for Kay and our baby and still be with you. It's impossible. Charity, we can work this out. I'm sorry to interrupt, Miguel. Will you excuse us a second? Yeah. Why not? What's going on? You can't let Kay come between you and Miguel. You guys... You don't understand. It's not just Kay. It's the baby. She has to be looked after. I can help look after her. Uh me too, and my dad will help out too, and so will Miguel's mother. There's no reason why you and Miguel being together would affect the baby. You don't understand. Yes, we do. You're a good person. You're always putting other people's happiness first. But it's time you started thinking about making Charity happy. Putting yourself first. You and Miguel belong together. I could strangle that sister of mine. Yeah, and Simone, my ex-best friend. Always putting their noses into things that are none of their business. Butt out! In my heart, I always knew that you and Miguel were meant to be together. And yes, I understand that you're concerned about Kay and the baby. But Miguel said that he would always be there for him. Make sure they had everything that they needed. Miguel needs you. Think about that, Charity. He'll never be happy without you. <sighs> no! If you go back to him, you'll kill my baby! What do you think you're doing, Kay? I'm trying to strangle Charity! You don't have the power to reach through that water and grab Charity like I do, when my powers are working. Yeah, well, I can try. I will not let her have Miguel, and I will not let my baby die. Let's see if I have a little juice left. It's not raining. Where did that water come from? Sorry, Kay. That's all I can manage. Oh. Charity is such a liar. She's reneging on her deal with death. She's getting back together with Miguel. No, I am not going to let that happen. Nobody threatens my daughter's life. Nobody. I'm going to stop Charity once and for all. And you're going to help, Tabitha. All right, all right. I'm trying. I have a lot to lose, too, you know. Wrong, Charity? I was serious about what I said before. I'm not going to give up on us, Charity. Okay, I'm never going to give up. I love you too much. There's no way that I could ever be happy without you in my life. I can't be happy without you either. Then stop pushing me away. <sighs> I don't get it. I mean, don't you love me anymore? Well, then that's all that matters. Sometimes love isn't enough, Miguel. It is for us. 
and I'm not letting you go. Don't just stand there. Do something. <sighs> no matter what I do, I can't increase my powers. They are at minimal strength right now. Well, can't you cast a spell or something? Not one that will prevent Miguel and Charity getting together. Wake up, Endora. Why? If she had enough powers to give Reese that ripped body, she might have enough powers to rip Charity and Miguel apart. Oh, no, no, no. We can't wake Endora up. Why not? Because she gets very cranky when she's woken out of a sound sleep. Well, I don't care. Well, you will if Endora is shocked awake. I mean, I mean, she might lash out and use her power to turn us into a couple of toads. No. We will wait until she wakes up on her own, and then we will enlist her help. We can't wait, Tabitha. Miguel and Charity are getting closer by the minute. Well, Endora will be awake in a minute. There's no time. I've got to go up the ski lodge and stop them myself. Hey, Kay, don't go rushing off half cock. Do something rash, and everything could backfire on you. Yeah, well, I can't just stand around here waiting for a magic spell that probably won't ever happen. Well, what do you think you're going to do when you get up there? I'm not sure. Let's see. They're all up there snowboarding, right? Yes. Well, Charity's new at that. Accidents happen all the time on the slopes, right? You mean... You... Well, why shouldn't something happen to Charity? She's inexperienced. All kinds of bad things could happen to her on those mountains. None of them good. Uh, Kay, Kay, uh, don't you think you should think this through, dear? Dear. Oh, I hope. I almost forgot. I haven't even registered yet. Don't go anywhere, okay? We still have a lot to talk about. I love you. Where are you going? <laughs>